raising students' awareness of all of the wonderful people in the school community who are doing things on behalf of the students. And so we started by, by eliminating all of the benefactors that are at the school, including resource teachers and board members and parent volunteers. And we created a material, a three-part card material, which I have samples of here, um, that they they then used to be able to learn a lot about what the different community members were doing. And then we went through a whole writing workshop curriculum. It was about four to six weeks worth of uh, lessons where the students were introduced to different concepts of gratitude, including things like what did it cost the benefactor, what is a benefactor, what is a benefit. And they wrote stories from their lives um, about each of those concepts and incorporating them. And then towards the end of the program, they wrote thank you letters to the benefactors and gave them um, to the benefactors and read them out loud to them in something called a gratitude visit. And so that was the gratitude program that I did with my students. And I was interested in seeing how that would affect how they express gratitude and if it would have any impact on their engagement in school. So that was an, a problem area that we had identified as a staff. Um, and so to strengthen the relationships between the teachers and adults and the students is one way to sort of raise intrinsic motivation through relationships, strengthening relationships. And so we went and measured um, first their expression of giving compliments versus getting compliments at a class meeting. And we started out with about 20% giving compliments and we went all the way up to about 73% of the students who would prefer to give a, give a compliment rather than give them get a compliment. So their, their expression of gratitude really increased. Um, also, we had a pre-test and a post-test of writing samples where they described um, a time in their life when something good happened to them. And I wanted to see if they would apply the concepts uh, before and after, and those also increased, um, as well as the quality and quantity of their work increased. Um, and then during the student engagement part of the study, uh, we had teacher, um, teacher questionnaires, student questionnaires. We also tracked on-task and off-task behaviors in the classroom. And we also saw an upward trend in all of those different measures. And so the conclusion would be roughly, since it's an action research and I was a participant researcher, so it's not a clinical study, but um, we were able to conclude that there was most likely a positive impact of the gratitude program, not only on their um, feelings of gratitude, their expression of gratitude, um, but also on their engagement in the regular day, uh, day in and day out of everyday life in school. And so that, that's sort of the, the sum of it. And um, so throughout this this, uh, this research, I also developed a gratitude program. Um, so I have a manual that I've made as well, so that teacher, other teachers can replicate this in their classrooms.